All right, what's up, guys? Um, wanted to do another video um, of my other Charvel. Um, I've got a video up up for my San Dimas. This is the actually the first guitar that I bought um, this year for uh, that's a Charvel. Um, this is the Pro Mod uh, SoCal. Um, awesome, awesome guitar. This is this might be my favorite guitar right now. Uh, it goes back and forth between this and the San Dimas, but I'm pretty sure this one's just, oh, it, in my opinion, it just sounds a little bit better. It feels just about the same, but it just sounds just a hair better. It might just be the pickups, and it might just be because it's a little different um, than what I'm used to. Um, this one has, uh, as you can see, uh, instead of just being rear routed like the San Dimas is, it's, it's top routed like a like a real Fender Strat would be. So you've got the pick guard here, but it's a black uh, single ply pick guard. Uh, original Floyd Rose. Uh, quarter sawn maple neck, jumbo frets, um, Floyd Rose 1000, single volume, uh, three-way selector, but it's the same cool volume and selector switch as on the uh, the San Dimas, uh, like the beveled volume and the, the like cool selector there. Um, this comes with the Seymour Duncan distortion set, so distortion in the bridge, distortion in the neck, um, different sounding than the San Di than the um, than the uh, JB and the 59 for sure. Uh, a little more bite. Doesn't cut quite as well to my ears as the JB, but still cuts really well. Um, just like really heavy, really smooth. Um, a little more bass uh, in the uh, the neck pickup than the the 60 or than the uh, 59. So it's you know it's a little different, but still like you get good cleans, you get good gain, you get good lead. Uh, it just I mean a really really cool pickup set. And I think this, just like the Hot Rodded Humbucker set, which is the JB59, so the Distortion set and the Hot Rodded set, I think are both 130 bucks new. So it's the same price range for pickups, just different ones. Um, these are actually 900 uh, brand new, but I actually got a pretty okay discount on this one. Um, I think I got it for 800 uh, Anyway, Floyd Rose, the front uh, jack, so it's not down here. It's on the front like a, like a Fender Strat would be. Um, but uh, I'm running through the tones on this, pretty similar, but uh, a little bit of difference. Hopefully, it comes off, comes off on the camera. Same thing, um, Mesa Boogie Dual Rec, boosted with the MXR Zach Wild Overdrive uh, into the Marshall Mode 4 cabinet. So I'll just play some some riffage here for you. <laughs> definitely in charge um, stays in tune like crazy uh, played it a couple shows it just cuts like crazy I mean just a killer badass guitar all the way around um, same thing pretty sure that the uh, coils are are split and they're wired out of phase uh, in the middle position so you get that kind of chimey strat sound uh, it's pretty cool I'll show you what I mean just leaving the Zach Wild uh, overdrive on, just just on as a boost. The gain's all the way off. It's but the uh, output's all the way up. So. <laughs>
Texas Blues guy. But you get that cool Texas Blues like sound, the very like. <laughs> Just cool, um, and uh, show you the cleans are actually really great with the distortion too. I was a little uh, had to play with it a little bit, had to play with the pickup height. It's definitely kind of a hot pickup, meant to do like those neck pickup leads, um, but gets some really good cleans out of it too. said sounds great live quarter song make will neck as you can see one piece just just awesome um, also Dunlop straps go with the Dunlop straps they're just they're fucking incredible um, anyway so play it out a little bit but uh, thanks for watching subscribe uh, to my channel if you like what you see um, like it leave a comment if you have any questions I do try to answer all the questions um, left so uh, please, if you like, subscribe, and uh, thanks a lot.